What's going on everyone? It's April 6, 2020, another weekly growth video. Um, so before I start, you guys might look at the, you know, look at the thumbnail and you see, you know, Cloud in there, Final Fantasy VII. Um, honestly, before I started making Langrister video, like I said before, if you're totally new to my channel, um, I used to be a professional fighting gamer. So before I do a lot of tutorials and stuff, it's just like how I do in Langrister, but I've been out of the scene. I start stopped competing for a few years, so you know, and then posting these Langrister videos as a hobby slash guide, trying to help the community. And I lost a lot of subscribers. I used to have over 10k, and I lost probably over 6k of my previous one, and probably even more because now I'm kind of overwritten with the Langrister um, subscribers and followers, I should say. So, um, and I've been. With my weekly growth video, you, before I only talk about the the game, right? But now I've been a little bit more personal, especially during this quarantine time. Um, I treat you guys like... Well, a lot of people have been messaging me in-game when they bump into me. When we do our farming and stuff, people are, people are very supportive. They're like, oh, we're a big... Um, here, I'm a big fan, blah, blah, blah. I love your video. Honestly, I love you guys. You guys have been supporting a lot. I mean, to me, it's... I'm just... <laughs> it's just a hobby for me. I'm just doing whatever, and if you guys are liking my videos, I'm providing uh, entertainment. I treat you guys like friends. I talk to you, you guys, whoever messages me. If I do read your message in game, I reply 100%. Um, even YouTube comments, sometimes I do, but sometimes there's just so many, I just skip some of them, right? But I treat you guys like, you know, friends, even though we never met, but some people who always leave the same comment, I really appreciate it. Um, and yeah, I've been uh, trying to talk more than just game. Trying to, you know, you guys probably watch, some of you will watch this maybe once a week or every day. So I'm more like someone you, you, like you feel like you know me kind of thing, right? You get what I mean? I, I know it sounds a little bit weird, but yeah, I try to be more, um, a little bit more personal than just my game because I've been telling you guys about my job like me owning like gaming cafes um what i do uh, my my web's a bitch sometimes um but yeah i uh, joke aside so yeah i appreciate you guys for watching these and supporting especially right now i've just been of course we all you all should be home wash your hands and there's really nothing to do aside from well there's work at home um a lot of games and just trying to upload YouTube videos so you guys have entertainment and so a lot of people have messaged me it's like yo just upload more videos right now it's like it's especially right now it's really boring we want to watch more of your video so that's that made me really happy I forgot who said that I, I I did remember his or her username um anyway so Final Fantasy 7 is coming out I it's my favorite RPG since I was younger, so when that comes out, um, I probably will make some video and post it here. I don't know how many of you will play that game. More than welcome to you know. Talk about it with me, even in the comments below. And anyway, so now we're gonna talk about the game. I don't know why. I just feel like I want to talk to you guys. Um. So nothing really happened. Um, like you guys can see, all most of my videos are the Apex one. I just have so many videos I just want to share because I always read um, people saying that, especially on Facebook, people are like, oh, blah, 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 Apex sucks, we can't enjoy it, you have to be really, you have to spend money to be there or you have to be really, really good. I mean, you don't have to be really, really good. It depends on where, what your achievement is in it, right? Um, you don't have to spend money. It's really hard. Honestly, if you want to compete against Whale, th that's absolutely no. But there's also a lot of people like you or myself that spend close to nothing. And it comes to all about strategy and stuff, right? Have fun. Just don't take it too seriously. You know, the incentive is, you know, like when you see all these incentives, it's like extra, right? You don't really need it. Anyway, so I'm going to talk about I barely hit gold one right before the clock ends. So. I was able to win the very last match and I hit goal one. Man, it was a grind, I'm telling you. Um, and I definitely had to switch my box back to kind of my season two box, except excluding him. So everyone you see here is from season two. 
Um, I switched out... Well, I was using Bernhard a lot, but I went back to Leon. Because I think Leon just does a little bit better. I switched out Rainforce. This magical hair guy suck ass. He is good, but he... He needs to charge that um, passive, his talent. And this shit is too much. Seven times. I think when he's six stars, it's still seven times. So that's a big problem. So until his 3C drops, he, he's hard. You need him to... Like your tank needs to be able to just sit there. And let him charge. Once he gets that seven charge, he's like awesome. I do have a video using him and then wrecking people but there's a lot of counters because he's short leg and you do want to use well you can use apex boot but when I think of it you don't it's not necessary especially he is not someone who goes into like an actual battle his skills are very far already you can see um, seven blocks six blocks so that apex boot doesn't help you too much that's my opinion anyways um so hit that, and honestly, I think season. If I hit Langrisser this season, I'll be really happy still using <laughs> these kind of boxes. But I think season four, I really have to get ready and go some, you know, dirty route. Because it is a little bit stressful and it is a grind. We can see 82 games, but honestly, it's already half of what I played last season. Last season, I think I played 160 something games to hit Langrisser or less. Season 1, I played almost 200 games to hit Langrisser. But now it's already half, and I'm pretty close. But there's some games that are really rough. You gotta, <laughs> you play some whales, you play those OP meta box, and you're like, oh shit. Alright, let's collect my reward. And, oh shit, there's a lot of shit going on. Uh-huh, right, you can see. The reward is very, the incentive is really good. If you can't get it, that's fine. Just get whatever you can. Play whatever you can, it's... It's fine. What the fuck? This sucks shit. There you go. So you need all those effort, you only get these. Barely any SSR. Um, yeah. So I think Final Fantasy drops. Um, I already dropped Final Fantasy um, War of the Vision. Don't get me wrong, that game doesn't suck that much. It's just another main game where you have to spend most of your time. So I'm already playing this. <laughs> And I enjoy this a lot. There's no reason for me to start another main game. I don't have time. But I've been looking into other different games. So hopefully I can find another side game. But right now 587 coming out in like 4 days. So I'm ready for that. And I got my um, strategy squad crystal. And I just applied to get my another 20... Whatchamacallit. 20 Vulture, so I am pretty much ready for every banner is coming out. I don't look at the future banners. I always just try to keep it, you know, as a surprise for myself. I don't like spoilers. So, I'll be, have a lot of ticket, and I'll see if I'm going to change my box any more, or I'm just going to settle with getting Langrisser and call it a day. Well, we'll see what happens. Um, Hero-wise, nothing really changed. Um... I changed him to horse, but I think I'm already at the verge of changing him to a flyer and then call it a day. But I'm gonna see. I think in season four I'm gonna have to drop him. As much as I like him, I really need to think. Oh, well, this this fucker sucks too. In Apex, he's just not that good. You need you need other characters to in your box to carry to make him look useful. But you, if you want him as a carry character, no. Sakura is still babe. Um, I changed him to Lancer, so I'm trying to finish him off, but I'm still lacking some, whatchamacallit, level. Then I'm going to use him in um, Timeless Trial, regular um, events. She's almost done. These, lacking some level. This one, I just slap it on her because I have a um, duplicate. And then I will have her bonding done soon. I just don't have enough resources right now. I do have enough gold. Um, other than that, I got her to four stars. I don't know if I'm going to build her. I just have her four stars right now, just in case. But she's in so many fashion that I play myself. So maybe I'm going to use her. Um, she She's sexy, so I, I want to use her. 
I'm him. Eventually, I will build him. Yu Yu is my favorite. And as you can see, I'm already almost done here. Then I'm going to use two runestone and do that. And probably just use him for PvE. PvP, I'm pretty sure he sucked ass. She's someone I always, you know, very interested in building for Apex, but unfortunately he's the only faction buffer as of right now, and I don't use Tarita, so there's basically no faction buffer for her. And Bolso is usually banned, unless I pick him very quick. He's someone, she's someone I want to use, but 3 stars, all these heroes 3 star, 3 star, so. Yep. Um, training wise, I finally look attack 70%, which means I have mastered all the attack right here and right here. And I'm telling you, this is a grind, this is a real grind, and that's pretty much it. Let's look at um, equipment here. Oh, and time rip, I have finally started catching up here. That's why I got a lot of more crystals and tickets. So I'm going to finish these off. You know why I kind of stop here? First, I'm lazy. And second, I realize she's not going to turn into uh, six stars anyways, even after I finish this. That's where the motivation went down. Um, uh, what were we going to say? My bag. Look at my bag. One day I'm going to use this shit, man. So let's look at the equipment here. Let's sell the garbage. Um, I got another one of this, but I already ordered it because I think I'm only going to build one with dupe. Got another one of this from Thunder Dragon. It's rare, but it's not very good. But I'm just going to save it in case I can use it in the future. Um, I got another one of this. I ordered it already because I probably will only use one. This one I am building on. I don't know. I'm just slapping. Because I have five. I just slowly building it with dupe. The rest are probably, or nothing really good that I got this week, honestly. I didn't get anything, honestly. Everything is an or. I got another one of this from Timeless Trial. Or they already. That is it. I think I got this again. I'm saving it. Just this one's pretty good. For infantry, it's actually possibly one of the best. Really, really good. Make them very tanky. And didn't get much. All right. And I think that is it. Yeah, basically this week's accomplishment was getting to go one. And how many weeks do we have left? We have four, I think. Yeah, we have exactly four weeks left. And I hope to make play off again. And that's pretty much it. Other than that, um, what else? What else? I think that's it. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to like the video. Maybe share it to your friends who also play Langrister, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye bye.